Hello from the Stadium of Light, and we certainly hope it will be an illuminating experience. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And coming up for you very shortly, live action from League One. It is Sunderland, and they take on Sheffield Wednesday. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the option back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Linden Gooch, number 21, Alex Pritchard, and number 14, Ross. Well, that's from the rule over the Sunderland starting lineup. Well, although we have it down as a 4 5 1, it's actually more likely to be a 4 2 3 1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10, and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. Here's the Sheffield Wednesday starting 11. Well, it looks as though they're lining up fairly defensively with a back five. But I think the wing-backs will have licence to get forward at every opportunity. And also watch out for one of the central midfield players going to join the front two. And now they get the ball rolling. Camberi. Crossing possibilities. Well, playing at home is something they enjoy, Stuart. This is very much a stronghold, so it's no surprise to note that they have the best home record in the league. Well, nine wins from 11 games is a great record, but it's no surprise, really. The level of performances have been brilliant in front of... Wonderful chance! And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Iorfa, Lee Gregory, Lewis Wing, Bannon, well they keep passing away, Camberi, Gregory on the ball, losing possession a bit easily, Well, he could run onto it here. And a good take under duress there. Alex Pritchard. Stewart. Can he make it count? And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Bannon. Lee Gregory. Hunt. 
I must say this looks promising. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. Gives it a go. Oh, a superb save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, still an issue here. Barry Bannon. It's a neat move. Well, they get themselves level here. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? He's driven in the corner. Well, he'll be a bit deflated following that effort, but he was being tightly marked. Pass easy on the eye. Ball is loose. Just the clearance that was called for. Firing it in. Still could be dangerous. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, very close to half time now, and it's a narrow lead for the home side. Stuart, how would you assess what you've seen? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. How can they open up the defence here? And he clears the danger. Richard. Really good interception. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Chance to cross. Bannon. Real chance. And there goes the whistle. Well, we spoke about it earlier. A fantastic record they have at home. So not exactly a shock to see them in front at the break. Well, they play such good football here. It's sharp, it's inventive, and at times it's clinical. If they can just get more control of the midfield area, I'm sure we'll see them extend their lead. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Onayan. It's with Gooch. Alex Pritchard. Neil. Stewart. And options in the centre. Well, they couldn't do anything positive with the cross. And out for a throw in. Just misfiring with the pass. Now sliding in field. Perfect tackle. Now that would be straightforward for any keeper. Lee Gregory. Camberi. Now just couldn't keep the ball. 
Well, as those stats tell us, Sunderland have been second best in terms of possession. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Well, offside by the merest of margins. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Thirty minutes to go then. Oh, good use of the ball. This firing without any shadow of a doubt. Same, a gift for any goalkeeper. Poor pass under no real pressure. It should be. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, let's look at that again. I'm almost lost for words here, Derek. It's really sloppy defending. You can't be giving the ball away in such a dangerous area like that and not expect to get punished. It's just really poor. So, 2-0 now. Could cross it in here. Struggling to keep the ball. Neil. Fifteen minutes left for play. No luck keeping possession. Wing. Callum Patterson. The cross is on. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. Substitution then, let's see how it affects the match. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately, well no problems defensively. No real conviction in the challenge. Now defending always has to be a team effort, good piece of covering. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball, and they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round.
Lee Gregory. Callum Patterson. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Stewart. Gooch. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. A really vital interception. And there it is, the final whistle. Well, we ought not to be shocked by this result considering the fine home record here. Well, they just keep producing great displays here. And today, it was their positional rotation that was so inventive. The result was never in doubt, was it?